Hi, this is Dr. Chef. Welcome back to our channel. And today we are going to make a, a vegetable patty. Okay, now our pan is really hot. I'm going to put, this is making the vegetables ready for our patty. So we are just going to saute these vegetables to this little oil. I'm going to add some cumin seeds. Some coriander seeds. We want to keep it very dry because we're going to add it to our vegetable mixture which we have already done and we have cooled it in the fridge. Now this is what this dry vegetables, we don't want to cook these vegetables too much so we can just add it to to our mashed vegetables. Now I'm gonna add my vegetables, which is carrots. You can add green cabbage or red cabbage. Red cabbage is good because it is kind of dense. In to this, I'm gonna add my chili flakes. And just saute it a little bit. Still dry. You don't want to cook it also too much. To this also I'm gonna add little turmeric powder, little, not too much. And my onions. All this should not be cooked too much because we're gonna mix this in the mashed potatoes. Very less oil. There you go. Let it dry. Cook. Should not leave any water because the onion has a tendency to leave water. So keep it on a high flame and cook it fast. Okay. So now you can see this is just what I want consistency. It is kind of. Uh, cooked well, not cooked well, but kind of raw in the sense that it is crunchy. And that's what we want. Now all I'm going to do is take it up, cool it and mix it to my cool mashed vegetables. Okay now copper chef back again. This is uh, our, our, our vegetable patty. So this is the chilled potatoes, broccoli and cauliflower which is all mashed up. The reason I mashed it up is because people don't like to see it whole. Now to this I'm going to add some peas which have been cooked and then uh, this is some chickpea flour. It will give a nutty taste to it. This is a ginger powder. You can add fresh ginger, fresh garlic, garlic powder, parsley and some fennel seeds, okay? And we're gonna mix this all together. While our vegetable, which we just sauteed, is gonna, is uh, getting cool in the fridge. So I don't want that to be very hot and cool this thing down so that is why I'm using this thing. So to this we're going to add some breadcrumbs also and to make it dry. So now we mix this well, all the powders and everything. Now our chilled vegetable, I'm going to add it to this so we can start making patty. Definitely, we're going to add some salt, about a teaspoon of salt. I'm going to mix this again. To this, I'm going to add some breadcrumbs. So it absorbs and become kind of crispy. If you want, you can add some rawa 
also to this so you can see wow that's how dry it should be and mix it well so it coats well and now we're going to make some patties out of it and again breadcrumb it again Okay, so this is how you gotta make the patties for that. So we can uh, put it on a breading station and get it ready. And just make it round real bit and let it sit down. And this is another last one. So we got about 12 patties out of this whole thing. That's how they should look. There we go. Okay, this is our veggie patties. And now we're gonna just bread them well. Like I said, so this is a vegetarian patty, so we don't want to put them with anything but just some breadcrumbs. This is cornmeal. Coat them properly. And then put them them nice and round and put them in breadcrumbs the breadcrumbs will make it crispy and nice so that's what we're gonna do okay that's that's how it should be and let's sit here Okay, so now our patties are, we got about 14 patties and they're all ready and we are ready to shallow fry them. There's about four tablespoons of oil and that tablespoons of oil is spread out very well. And this is really hot now. Um, the reason we are shallow frying them is because we don't want to break the patty. Okay, there we go. It's, now it is, it is, uh, two two minutes on each side now I'm gonna turn it off over you see how it is nice and crispy okay, so now this is nice and crispy so you can see this both sides is cooked well and I'm gonna take this out and take all of this out now and then I'm gonna put the rest of the patties rest of the patties in voila this is all done now our veggie patty is ready I'm gonna taste it and let you know how it, it is look it's nice and it's holding up good on my spoon I'm gonna Oh my god, it's amazing. Mm. <laughs> I hope I hope you like this recipe. And if you like this recipe, give us a big thumbs up. Join us on Pinterest and like us on Facebook and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Happy cooking!